So that's my contraption. And uh, I got sidetracked because I found something. And it was uh, shooting over there towards those trees. So I had to swim out there in the current and get it. And I'll, I am completely soaking wet. But I don't care because I found something. And uh, I marked it with my tomahawk. I know what it is. It's a good find. Some of you who have watched, you're, uh, you're going to recognize it for what it is, probably. If you uh, pay attention to my uh, channel and watched my videos, which is a small number of you, but a number of you just the same. And this is uh, some of the stuff I'm uh, walking through looking at right here and I almost picked it up and I stopped myself because I realized what it was the last second so I have it marked here on my tomahawk and uh, as I said I know what it is and uh, the giveaway is this piece right here because that's a tooth it looks like there's a tooth here from that angle it looks like there's a tooth in the mouth right here this is a jawbone this is I'm, I'm gonna guess right now that this is a bottom jawbone but I'm not sure because I haven't tried to pull it out yet obviously and uh, we'll find out together Let's just give it a little test here okay it comes out easily here's the tooth all the way back here and there's teeth in it and that is the jaw of a giant ice age beaver that is a cool find a very cool find we'll take it down here and rinse it off i didn't see that bottle so we'll take a look at that later oh. yep that's exactly what that is that is so cool so this tooth used to come up and, and if you look at some of my videos you'll see it that comes up and gets pretty long and you can see it's back here into the jaw it's back into here these are the the molars and I'll tell you that's got heft to it that is that is a very good find that is very cool I'm tickled pink I am tickled pink I know I'm out here a little bit early like I said you can see the water was just high not long ago Holy cow, that's nice. This is, like I said, I got more, more road to travel here. And uh, I guess it looks like there's a tooth back here, but I'm not sure. But uh, man, that's cool. And I'll be able to preserve that pretty easily. It, it's, it feels like it's, it's already um, semi, semi uh, fossilized. It's got so much heft to it. But I got to, Get that in a box. Get it back in my uh, contraption, my inner tube contraption back there. And keep going. And we have, uh, you can see where I walked here. And uh, as I said, my contraption with the dog, the dog just, she's along for the ride. She doesn't care. And I saw it going and I thought, oh crap, I better run down there and get it quick. And right about then I glanced down and saw this and almost grabbed it. And I didn't. And I waited for you guys, which I'm glad I did. And uh, just had time to slam my tomahawk into the ground and take off running. So uh, we're not we're not far in this encounter today. Um, I haven't been out on this. Uh, I haven't been out on any river for a while now. Um, and again, it's like two or three weeks since I've been out. Um, a lot of that is because of. Uh, rain and some of that is because of people um, at work taking vacations and stuff like that causing me to have to kind of stick to home but I'm squeezing out this weekend real quick so that is a that's a cool find all right I'm gonna I'm gonna turn you guys off and uh, keep moving here in my wet clothing and uh, 
moving south. Keep hoping we're uh, we're gonna keep uh, that old uh, tale about the uh, early bird. So uh, we'll keep at it. It's looking pretty good so far. So thanks for sticking with me. We're gonna keep moving south and uh, hope the finds keep coming. So again, thanks for sticking with me. Catch you later.